Hi and welcome to Add More Zest. My name's Rebecca, also known as 4 Kids at 147, and I thought I'd show you some of the diamond paintings that I brought back from Australia. So these are Kaiser Craft brand called uh, Kaiser Sparkle. Uh, so they're so sold in Australia in Kaiser. Um, which is a shop that sells quite a few different bits. I used to get quite a lot of scrapbooking bits from them when I went there. Um, they had a 50% off their own brand items on their website. Oh, a few months ago, somebody posted it in the group. So I ordered six paintings and got them delivered to my mum and dad's. So I picked those up. I also did go into a couple of their stores while I was there picked up myself a nice new handbag, picked up something for one of the kids and I also picked up one of these small Kaiser sparkle things. Now they do also sell diamond dots but I didn't pick up any of those because I can get them here at Hobbycraft if I want to. I wanted to get some of their own brand. So this first one was six dollars. It actually says seven dollars ninety nine. This is Australian dollars by the way. That's what it says on the back but I'm sure I only paid six dollars for this. Um, and this was down as one of their like little kids kits they could do over the holiday because when I went it was summer so I decided to get this little sloth it is a partial uh, so you just pop diamonds on the sloth and three of the sort of leaves slash flowers but it comes with this small printed canvas let's have a look what size this one is oh it's in fact it says 12 centimeters by 12 centimeters which that is what it is inside the black line. So it is a true reflection of size. Inside the black line is 12 by 12. You then get a pink pen with a tip, a three placer, a green boat, a piece of wax and about four or five baggies. And it's only a few colors this one because of course it's a small one. So we just have some browns and some pinks, in fact we have a total of six different colours in this one. So I thought that would be a fun little project, little mini one, and I thought it was nice to see what they had as small items, but then I did get six bigger ones. Oops. There was 50% off, so I've only really paid for three and got six. I'm hoping it will have the prices on the box because I can't quite remember the prices. And I'm obviously struggling to get this into the packet, but it does have a description on the back. Um, but yeah, Kaiser is an Australian company. I'm not sure if they have anybody that sells their diamond paintings in the UK or not, but you may be able to order from their website direct to the UK. I didn't check that because I knew I was going, so I figured I'd send them to my mum and dad's and they could look after them for me. But first one, we're going to start with the smaller ones. So this has got a design size of 44 centimetres by 34 centimetres so this is close to a 40 by 40 and while I've looked at the front boxes I haven't actually gone in them yet so let's crack one of these open and see what they are like and get in it we so say it's a 30 by 40 or 30 34 by 44 so slightly bigger than a 30 by 40 and that's the actual design size it is poured glue which is good um, it's your standard sort of canvas it's not got your fancy edges or anything uh, this cover paper is quite thin but it's okay sticky which is good symbols look nice and clear 
uh, look really nice and clear. So this one has 28 different colours and they do have DMC numbers, which is good. Uh, and this one is 34 by, well, it's actually nearer 43. The only thing that is a little bit weird um, is if you look down the edge, it's like there could have been another row of diamonds. I'm not sure what that line is down the edge, but it's actually down both edges um, and across the bottom. So I don't know whether, I don't think that actually is a line. No, it's not a line that's starting the symbols. It's like a perforation line around the edge. And it is actually across the top as well. And it is lines, it's not like letters. So rather than doing a bold solid line, they've done a dash line all the way around the outside, which is a little bit weird. But this one comes with your nicer basic toolkit, or I like to say is your nicer basic one. It comes with the white tray. You do get a grip for your pen, three placer, wax, and some baggies. And your diamonds come in strips. So I do have six, so I'm not gonna go through every single color because this video would be far too long. But that is a really nice pink background. And the background does have a pattern. So it's not solid colour. So can you see it has some very pale, subtle flowers in the background. But they are there. And if you look at the image, if my camera will focus, you can see that there is subtle, subtle decorative parts on the background. So it's not a solid, solid background colour. There is a lot of the letter F, which is 818, which, yeah, is that colour. So there is a lot of it, but it does then mix in with a few of the other styles of pinks. We've got some gorgeous turquoise. So that is number one. Mr Koala, I am adding so many to my stash down here to add to my logbook but that was design number one they do have loads i just picked my favorites i'm not even going to try and get it back in that bag because that's just not going to happen uh, my next small one this again is 34 by 44 so very close to your 30 by 40, but not quite. It does have details on the back. Oh, in fact, it does have. So these are down as 28.99 Australian dollars on the back. I say it was a half price sale when I got them. So let's get in the plastic and I'm not going to try and get back in it. So let's just get rid. And then this one is actually a landscape. And I picked this Kingfisher. Absolutely loving the flowers in this one. Again, the background has a nice subtle detail around, um, well, the hummingbird, sorry, around the hummingbird. Uh, and these are the colors. So we've got some really nice bright colors in there. Bright pinks, bright oranges, there's some gorgeous turquoise colours as well as some that are a little bit more muted. Let me move the tape measure out of the way because I don't need that. So that was design number two that I chose. Say so I just wanted a variety of things and I like the fact that they're their own branded so they're not necessarily designs I can get elsewhere. So that's the hummingbird. The other one's called Aussie Koala. Uh, this one is another one at $28.99 Australian. Uh, this one is a dream catcher. Oh. Find the bag. There we go. And again, this one is 34 by 44. This one is portrait. Now this one does, <coughs> excuse me, this one does have a solid background colour, but it is a gorgeous blue. What blue is it? 
3756. So a really nice blue background for this one and some gorgeous blue feathers. So as you can imagine, in fact there it is, it's like a very pale minty blue is the background colour and then we have some pinks and some more gorgeous blues and some purples which every time I, there's not too many purples so every time I tip the packet back up they all sink. You see them disappearing? Uh, so we have some purples in there as well. So they're the three smaller ones that I got, but they also do some in a bigger size. So let me make sure I keep everything together. Because otherwise I could make a royal mess in here. So that's the three smaller ones. This next one is 54 by 44 centimetres and this one has a retail price of $37.99 and again that's Australian dollars. So this one is Rainbow Parrots. I think one of my favourite ones is actually the next one. Uh, so we have Oh, this one's slightly different. These have all been round as well, by the way. But looking at the edging on this one, it has like a little black scalloped edge. So you'll see black around your diamonds when you're done. It's like scalloped around the top part, which is a little bit different. This does have a primary solid background, but there's not much background in it. So it is just this turquoise colour for the background with then the white swirls. There's not sort of subtle changes between the two. It is turquoise or white, but as I say, there is not too much background in the whole of this. And the fact that it's got these white bits in would definitely break it up for you. Uh, but this is definitely bigger, as you can see. Gorgeous bright colors in this one. That's what I liked. It has 24 different colours for this one and we have quite a few bright colours, quite a few turquoise, yellows, pinks, blues. Uh, we've got some purple as well. But yeah, some nice brighter colours for this one. So that is number four. We do get the posher toolkit also. Let's get that one back in the box. This one is giving me some right trouble. Hang on a moment. Let me see if I can get this one to go back in. Say, if I don't end up getting them back in the box, while I'll still be able to work out which one's which, it will be entertaining, should we say. Uh, so this, I think, is my favourite one. I don't quite know why. I just like the colourings of it. But this one is called Greenhouse. Again, the design size is 54 by 44. For the round numbers, the canvas size is 60 by 50. So I think that's what's made the default design size a little bit smaller is the canvas is 60 by 50 and that makes the design size 54 by 44. But I just love this one. I just, I just think it's gorgeous. Uh, it is orientated this way, but I'm sure this is one that you could put any way up. Uh, but the actual design is round this way. Now this this doesn't have a dash line and it doesn't have that black line around it either. Uh, the black scallop, this finishes, all the edges are just like any other diamond painting, like I would expect. But this is a more muted, colourful, succulent type, let me look at those pastel colours. Even the limey type green or a hint of limey greeny yellow is pale. Uh, pale blues, whites, the odd little pop of colour, but primarily it is paler colours. 
and I just think it's gorgeous. I really do. Uh, it has 25 different colours in this one. So a nice colour range. And then last but by no means least, uh, the last one I chose to get is called Underwater. So let me get Greenhouse away. Uh, the last one is Underwater. Again, these are all round. They do show you on the front of the box, you can see that it's got sort of the schematic for it with diamonds. So this shows that it's round. Um, I don't know if it actually says round on it. No, it just says that it's a Kaiser Sparkle range. So while the image shows round, I didn't see any that were square. So I think they just do round in the Kaiser. And again, this has got a retail price of $37.99. But the underwater, yes, underwater as it's called. Let's get rid of these plastic bags. I've got one that's fell on the floor. I'll probably find that one later. So this goes up this way. But we have some turtles. Some turtle turtles, yeah. Sea turtles. Gorgeous. Look at those gorgeous blues up there. There are a few different uh, diamond colours used in the little different shading blocks. So it's not too blocky. This one finishes round the edge like I would expect a diamond painting to. And this has lots and lots of blues and purples and some gorgeous turquoise colours. Oh, in fact, you can see it better there. Gorgeous turquoise, a little bit of pink, little bits of purple, which you can see down here in the coral. Uh, gorgeous green colours as well. Some really, really pretty colours. But I do like my blue. Um, I am drawn to blue very often, so I think this will be a quite exciting painting to do. That's why I picked it up. It was nice to pick up a few that aren't readily available for me to pick up all the time. Not that I needed to add to my stash, but it's nice to have in my stash something a little bit different. Uh, and I do now have probably a few that I will keep in my box in the boxes. Uh, because I will keep these in the boxes, they will go into my large paintings pool. Even though these ones probably aren't considered as large. Um, I basically, my large is ones in boxes um, and my smalls are one hung up. So I, I may unpack these three because they are 44 by 34, so I will be able to hang these up. Uh, but these will definitely stay to go into my larger pool kits. And this one I will probably keep hold of for somebody um, to introduce somebody to diamond painting. But yeah, Kaiser Sparkle, I say they do have quite a few. There's quite a few Kaiser stores about, especially in the Victoria area. Um, which is where they're primarily based but I know I'm pretty sure there are now Kaiser shops all over Australia and they are online as well so if any of these take your fancy uh, do nip it's called Kaiser Craft which is that block lettering there kaisercraft.com.au and you can have a look at their Kaiser Sparkle range and See if any take your fancy like they did mine uh, but this was my biggest haul from Australia I do also have two paintings that I picked up from Lincraft that are also based in Australia ha however one of those is a little bit different I've never seen it in a store um, I've only seen it in diamond painting from one I've only seen it at one other company on 
one other company's website, um, one of the companies that I unbox for. So it's quite interesting, or I'm quite interested in showing you that one. So do make sure you're subscribed and stay tuned. Uh, the Linkraft unboxing, I think, is coming up next week. Um, so you'll be able to see what the, the last of the goodies that I got from Australia. But thank you all so much for joining me and for watching. Let me know in the comments which is your favourite and I'll speak to you all again soon.